What's up everyone, Tim Alman Jr. here, Mom Asylum Alcohol. Today I'm doing whoosh, Hopworks Abominable Winter Ale. Um, I picked them up, somebody said they were good. Um, but the picture itself just looks fucking cool. It's got a little Yeti on there. A little abominable snow creature. Urban Brewery. Alright. I mean, it's pretty fucking cute. It's like festive. They're like little tiki things. Which is funny because Yeti's living in the Himalayas. But, and they got like a Hawaiian esque look to them. And I don't think it snows in Hawaii. Huh. Anyway. Let's get popping. Oh, yeah. All right. Let's see. Hop Works Urban Brewery. Boom. Hub. Abominable Winter Ale. Um, Salmon Safe Certified Brewery Site. Okay. Certified Brewers Association Independent Craft. One percent for the planet don't know what that means um certified b corporation protect our planet which hop words um portland oregon now portland's i mean for you uh, liberals and leftists out there it's the great and best place for y'all for us uh Backwoods, country folks, rights, or kind of, you know, it's not the best place. But anyways, you know I don't support Portland. But, this is actually pretty cool. So I'm going to give them the benefit of doubt here. Plus, this is, whoosh, right there, look at that, look at that. 7.3% alcohol by volume in this 12 ounce can. That's fucking amazing. So, I don't know what their thing here is. I, I mean, they don't give you much more information on what their protect our planet, 1% plant for the planet. So, they don't really give much detail into that. Maybe 1% of... Um, the cost of each six pack sold goes to the planet in some way. So this is eleven ninety nine plus deposit. So sixty cents on top of well twelve dollars. Anyway, so. If you're one percent of twelve fifty nine, that's what was that one dollar, right? Wait, no, no, that's not right. Wouldn't it be like, would it be like one dollar and twelve cents, something like that. I don't know. My math's horrible. Obviously, that's why I drink. <coughs> that's why I'm not a math teacher. Um, or you know, some kind of engineer. Anyways, um. Forgot what I was gonna fucking say. Anyways, um, let's get into it, shall we? Somebody, said, that was a weird, a weird open, right? Towel on the floor. That's kind of fucking gross. All right. It's very, very hoppy. 
Oh. Frothy, too. And it's full as fuck. I don't know if you can see that, but it's like coming out. And it's just sitting there on the brim. Okay. Smells hoppy. It's not bad. Tastes like an IPA. Um, very hoppy, but it's actually pretty, pretty fucking decent. It just smells like hops. And tastes like hops, and it's foamy as fuck. So, a lot of burpage. A lot. But 7.3% alcohol by volume. Now, if you're a hops drinker and you like that very tangy, earthy flavor and you like froth, this is exactly what you need in your life. I mean, it's not bad. I actually like it. I think it tastes pretty fucking good. Um, but I don't really know what it is. It's a beer. Oh, it's an ale. Sorry. It's an ale. I don't know if it's a pale ale or what, but you know, I don't understand what they're trying to accomplish here because they don't give me much detail. But we're going to assume that Salmon Safe and it's 1% for the planet. So, and we all know how you libs are. Damn, that is actually pretty good. Really fucking good. Anyways. So, eleven ninety nine plus deposit. So twelve fifty nine. So we're looking at seven point three percent alcohol by the volume. This is actually pretty fucking high for a twelve ounce, and for your price, it's not too bad. Plus, it doesn't taste bad. If, in fact, this was your thing, um, but if it's not, then I don't recommend it. But if you're an ale guy or an IPA guy, same fucking thing. Ooh. Same fucking thing. Anyways, if you're an IPA, pale ale, whatever, um, this is it. So, anyways, I I do recommend it. It's not bad. It's not. Plus, it looks fucking cool. And if you don't like it, you can just keep a can on your fridge and. People will be like, that's a cool fucking artwork. And I'm like, and you're like, yeah, I know. A fucking Yeti on my fridge. Or it doesn't have to be a fridge, it can be a shelf somewhere. Anyways, point is, recommend, and <coughs> I'm going to give this a, I'm going to give it an 8. It's actually pretty fucking good. I like it. I enjoy it, actually. Maybe I'm becoming more man, you know? That ain't true, I'm not. But, anyways, thanks for tuning in. Yeah, you know. You know what I'm gonna say. Fuck off. <laughs>